All right, everybody, welcome back to some more Pokemon Insurgents. Today, we're going to be doing a lot of stuff. I'm going to be turning it down way too low because it's actually pretty loud. Because I'm actually looking at OBS right now and it's actually pretty loud. Okay, so this time we're going to be trying to beat up the Vipix City Gym. No off screen grinding this time, so don't try looking for the video. It doesn't actually exist. Uh, this time we're going to be leveling up Evie just a little bit before the gym battle. I'm thinking 39 should be a good point. And then we're going to continue onward and see if we can... I'm also thinking that maybe we should increase uh, the level of... Um, uh, what is it? Uh, Ghastly a little bit. I'm just going to go tell it. Why not? doesn't matter. So it's going to use Healing Wish. It's going to kill itself immediately. So yeah, so hopefully this time we're going to be able to beat the... Uh, what's his name? <laughs> I forget his name. Uh, Xavier. This time. Okay. Quick attack. Oh, I thought we'd be able to take it on one hit. I guess not. Since this is the fastest way of getting levels in terms of Pokemon Insurgents, might as well abuse the heck out of it. That's pretty much what I said last time. We're going to be abusing the heck out of this thing. It is much too easy for this to actually end up working. There's no point in not using this, to be fair. Sure, quick attack, why not? Doesn't matter. Not like it matters too much. trying to think so so in this case Xavier uses a shuckle at the beginning maybe we shouldn't have gotten rid of uh, nightshade because we could have used our level against it because shuckle has pretty bad health but it's got an insane defense it's gonna try no Okay, uh, let's see here. He's level of audio, not of our choice. Tw 20. Okay, let's see here. Sure. Trying to find out how I got towards the gym again. Oh, you have to do here. You have to go here. Okay. Good, good, good. Oh, my bad. Uh, quick attack again, why not? What's your gym? We're on normal difficulty, so should be easy to do it. Yeah, the only thing that we're going to have a rough time on is with the shuckle, because the shuckle sets up the sticky web, and that's what we kept running into a problem last time, was that we kept running into that. I don't think we have a... I don't think we have someone that can remove that. I guess it's mostly just over level until we have a good enough team member, I guess. Yeah, it's fine. Just whenever it gets towards the last one, we'll just switch to a crux. And we should be good. I don't know, shadow punch. It should be faster anyway. And then after this, uh, we're going to start to, uh, after the next gym, we'll actually level up the other Kazrelia, because I think we're going to need that electric typing later on. Uh, which one should we level up? We'll, we'll level up Azrelia as well. We'll level up both of them at the same time. Azrelia is not going to be as helpful in this, in this gym as much as, I think, the next one, I think, if I'm remembering it correctly. Actually, I don't even know if we have a counter for the next gym. Oh, we have Azrelia. Never mind. Well, Azrelia is going to counter. I think it's going to check two Pokemon. Oh, I'm trying to remember what his par his party was. Because all of them have a theme, and I'm trying to remember what the, what the third gym leader's theme is. I think we should be fine for the most part, I think. I could be wrong, though. 
There we go. I think 35 will be good for Ghastly. So one more time. Shadow Ball, let's go. Shadow Ball instead of Shadow Punch. Guaranteed or we get a Spadef drop. I think the Spadef drop is actually going to be much more needed. Okay. This is his last one, right? I think so. Well, we'll know. It is, okay. Uh, Aqua Tail, yeah. Also, Azrelia just needs to get more uh, friendship so that with a return does a lot of damage. And then something that I'll definitely do on the under the uh, the long recording session kind of thing of training. Uh, when we get enough money, pretty much to do EV training and EV reversion for I don't know Azrelia and all that, uh, we will definitely do a lot of EV training. But right now, I really don't want to go and work on that because it's not that it's not needed right now. It's more so that like if we do it now, it'll be easier later on. And I don't really want it to be too easy later on. I'd rather it be difficult right now and then later on when it feels more worth it. Okay, so we should be pretty stacked for the gym now. We should be. Okay, I don't think that any of his team members we really need to worry about too much aqua ring no if aqua ring was more so like a leech seed but for our side kind of thing like uh, every member that's on that circle will get the healing then yes i would definitely use aqua ring but that's not how aqua ring works so we're not going to use that okay now that we're done uh should we get items no, I don't think we're going to need items. It's considering the fact that I don't think Xavier ever used it. I don't know if I healed. Okay, let's bump up the audio just to back up to about... To where it was before. Oh, you have to do a setting again. Dang it, man. There we go. Okay, let's see if that's any louder. It's got different tweaks to it, so it should be fine. Okay, back to the gym. For one final time, hopefully. We should be pretty stacked. Azrela is not going to be as helpful, but that's because that's why we didn't level her up at all. Uh, we have Kazrela here. Did we actually see every member? I think we did. So the only thing that I don't know if we can counter is the Tentacruel, because I don't think we can have, actually have a counter for it. But we should be fine. Because I think as long as we get rid of the... Uh, Shuckle, Hunter, and the Beedrill. I think... Evie will be able to deal with it. Okay, what was the solution? I don't care anymore. Enter for stream, move forward until you need the wall, turn left. Oh. Turn left. Go forward. Go through the hole. Fight the bug catcher, we already did that. Then go over here. Go to the tree at the north. Uh, let's see here. Turn right. And go south. And exit out of it. There we go. There we go. Gonna save it here. Because we may want to go fight the trainers. What's going with the thing is out here? Blah, 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 blah. Yes, let's go. We already saw this in the last session. Okay. Let's try this again. We're now leveled up pretty high. So let's see if hypnosis will at least... If we still get the hypnosis off. Okay. We're two levels higher. This should be perfect. Should be a perfect run. We are faster. I was hoping for the spit F drop though. We still got the sticky web. But at least... The shuckle didn't do anything. Beedrill. Should we stay in? Or should we let Ghastly die? No, because Ghastly can check the Haunter. Because what does the Gat. What, is, what does his Hunter have? I think it has Ominous Wind as its Ghost type move. So let's go and switch to. Because what move will he end up using? 
There's got to be a reason why he's switching to Beedrill. Other than the Mega Evolution. Let's go with... Uh, we'll slow it down, actually. Uh, let's go with Drakitham. Hooray. If I need to edit that out, I will. Okay, go Drakitham. I don't think... Yeah, Drakitham doesn't have an item as of yet. Poison Jab. Okay. Should be taken out. Okay. So Drakitham may be... Out of the... Out of, out of the game. What's the next one? Okay, you're sending a Tentacruel already. Do I need you for anything, Drakitham? No. So we can actually eliminate you, but we'll see if we, you can at least do some damage. Smokescreen. Oh, I forgot it had clear body. I was hoping that it was like only like attack and defense kind of thing, not accuracy. Okay. So the Tentacruel is the only one that I have no idea if we can even counter. Let's see if we can use Kezrelia to check it. It's the sticky web that kills us right now. So we also have clear body. Please tell me we can take it out with this. I know you're going to use Toxic, but please take it out. Really? Really? It's going to use... Wait, it's going to use Venershock. I have an idea. We should switch to Crux. Because if we switch to Crux, it's going to use Venershock and it's not going to do anything. And it's going to waste. Aha, I see. That's smarter. Now, this would be the part where I would wish that Crux actually kept its quick attack. Because I don't think Faint's going to do a lot. Let's see. So, what, what could it possibly do? It can't Toxic, so I, so I can switch into something that will... And it'll be fine. I think Evie should be the next to switch into. The speed thing is the only thing that's hurting me right now. Okay, could drain. It shouldn't do a lot. Okay, Evie, come on. I believe in you. I need you to do a lot with your quick attack, please. I think next turn it'll remove it from the field. The Venner Shock is the only thing I don't know about. Take it out, please. Yes! Okay, we'll still be taking the poison damage, but that's fine. Okay, we only have healing is three, I think. Right? Healing is three members? Yes. What is it? Heracross. Evie has to be taken out. Can we actually outspeed him? By using tail? We can. Oh, let's go. We can do this prob probably. Let's do this. No, Evie can't survive. Okay. That's fine. So the way we countered this before was that we used Crux and it used Brick Break on us. And then we just used Counter and then it got rid of it entirely. So we're going to use that strategy again. Unless he gets a crit. Oh my god. Bye. There you go. So there's two more members. Crow Gunk. Are we faster than a Crow Gunk? Can I get the Paralysis off? Paralysis. We needed the paralysis and it didn't give it to us. So there's only two members, I think. He only has two members. And I don't remember what they both are, so we're gonna have a fun time with that. Uh, we'll go with Kazrelia. Because Kazrelia should check this Crow Gunk. I say should. It has dry skin. I don't think we can look at the ability. 
even if we chased it. Oh, there we go. We got the quad. There you go. Okay. Now, I don't know about the next one. Yeah, it's no, we're no longer badly poisoned, so that's, I think, the plus so far. Okay. We have two Mons that can deal with this. We should be in a better position. Psychic. Oh, but it does have Venoshock. I didn't anticipate that. Can we deal with this? We can. Good. Awesome. And that's the second gym leader done. Man, I can't believe I lost. Yeah, you lost. Man, I lost. How did you like my Beedrill, though? That's called Mega Evolution. It's pretty impressive, right? Maybe one day you'll get to do it, too. Obtain this Stinger Badge. Take this, too, with a gift from me. We got Venoshock. Awesome. Venoshock is usually a pretty mediocre move. It only has 65 power. Well, 65 base power. But if it is used on a Pokemon that's been poisoned, 